Hello everyone and welcome back to Two Bros Game Night. I am your host, Older Bro. I'm your other host, Younger Bro. And today we continue in Danganronpa, where we were, as I recall, looking for Kyoko. Who is on this floor. Yeah. Library. I guess oh it's just showing that everyone's on yeah. this floor. Well, yeah. Okay. So yeah, we Yeah, we have to go to the library. From... Yeah, to the library. Library. Uh, Lar Barber. There's the library. There's the lie barber. The lie barber. No, didn't we come from here? Oh, right. Where are we going to? And we'll find it the out. The stairs? Not the stairs. Okay, it's not in here. Oh, I probably know where she is. Hold on. We're on the third floor. Oh. Okay. Ha! Ah! That strange cry. It had to be Celeste. God damn it. It came from the floor above. She's on the third floor. I spirited to the third floor. Sprinted. Over here, everyone. Everyone had heard the scream and come running. Just a second. Oh, Celeste, what's wrong? What? That was rather intense scream for someone like you. Oh, I do declare. I saw the... The strange costume man. He ran off as soon as I screamed. I was blocking the stairs, so he headed further down into the hallway and disappeared. He must be down this hall. Come on. <laughs> what is it now? It's it. Launch. Yeah, seriously, they're doing launch. <laughs> Whoa, really is true. But doesn't matter right now. Yeah. Huh? That came from downstairs. It must have been Hifumi. He's in the nurse's office. This is bad. We gotta go back. What about the suspect? We've gone to all this trouble to capture him, right? Why don't we split up? There's like six of us. Then why don't we split into two groups? There we go. Hey, somebody listened. It's all clear now. I'll head... Lead. I'll lead the hunting party. That seems much more interesting. Very well. Then Makito and Hina... You come with me to the nurse's office. I will leave the capture of the suspicious individual to Toko, Sakura, and Byakuya. So we'll handle it. Just go take care of it, Fumi. Okay, you guys be careful. With that, we split into two groups. Me, Celeste, and Hina all ran downstairs to the first good floor. Idea. Just a second. Oh, he's in the nurse's office. Let's go. Uh, that is the nurse's right office. Right there. Right there. Hello, heart door. We stormed, yeah, we, god damn, I'm in uh, her voice now. Yeah. We stormed in the nurse's office, and what greeted us was a world of dripping crimson. No, 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 no. No, uh, that channel's uh, dead. Yeah, it's very dead. I knew it. That hammer is smaller than the last one. Everything was covered in red, even though everything's pink. And in the center of this pink was Hifumi? Well, Cartman's dead. It looks like something very bad has happened. I certainly was not expecting this. I didn't. I didn't imagine that Hifumi would be murdered. No way. Neither did oh, I. Murdered? You're not serious, are you? He's not really dead, is he? Ding dong, ding dong. You may use however you like. The class trial will begin. Oh God, this is gonna be interesting. The... That was the body. Also yeah. called it. I knew yeah. he'd be dead next. That was the body discovery announcement. The body discovery announcement. When three or more people discover a body after a murder, that's what plays. And since we just heard it, that means it must mean that Hifumi is dead. Even though I, that's clear. Someone killed him. One of us. One of uh, us? And look at that. When Celeste said that, she pointed to something. Something on the floor. Something that had also been on the floor after the last two attacks. It was that robot guy. Another hammer. Justice Hammer 3. And it's even bigger than the other two. Is it? If you say so. <laughs> it looks as big as two. Just as I suspected. One strike from that, and you're finished. 
Then the killer. There can be no doubt, the suspicious individual. Going by what Fumi called him, the culprit must be Robo Justice. Whoever's hiding in that costume is the one to kill Fumi. But wait! You saw him on the third floor, right? Running back into the hall? So how'd he end up in the nurse's office? You're not saying they like teleported or something, right? We can figure that part out later. Right now we have to tell the others. You're right. So then. then shall we go? Uh, but I, I loved him. Uh, <laughs> that actually might be her reaction. Hina, snap out of it. Uh huh. Are you okay, Hina? Sorry, Sorry uh, I'm not sure I can move right now. I'm feeling kind of. Mm. This is a problem. We can't just leave Hina here alone. She might vomit on the crime scene and destroy <laughs> some evidence. Okay, then I'll go get everyone. You stay here with Hina. Mm. Very well. I'll leave it to you then. Okay, I'll be back soon. No, I tried to sound confident. No one should be alone right now. No. I tried to sound confident and upbeat, but I suddenly stopped trembling from what I'd just been through. Should have just offered to carry Hina. <laughs> everyone else is already on the third floor. I have to hurry. And I'm on the third floor. This is where everyone was chasing this suspicious individual. Where was he headed? Blah, blah, blah. We've heard this all before. Further down into the hallway. So towards the that one, one minute time machine that may or may not be true? I guess. Way back in the back of the hallway. If we go around a corner and die, that'd just be hilarious. Oh, yeah. That would be bullshit. Oh, God. She wasn't kidding. This... Yes. As far as I can tell, there's nobody here, but I still feel some kind of presence. I'm sure I feel their presence. The presence is coming from the back? Okay, we're going into the back. Kyoto. I leapt through the doorway, and when I did, I found another nightmare. The second nightmare of the day was waiting to greet me. Oh, no. Double KO. There in a pool of his own blood was Taka, dead. Oh, God. Two people died. Yep. Well, we on the plus side, we know no one else can die because you're only allowed to kill two people. Hifumi's body discovered in the nurse's office. Taka's body discovered in the equipment room. I was witness to two nightmares, one right after the other. No, they weren't nightmares. This is harsh reality. I swear, if that actually is a one-minute time machine, and that's... Because I said they're going to have some bullshit where it's impossible for two people, for them to be in the same place and commit the murder. And now they're going to use that bullshit because they killed Taka, teleported back in time a minute, went downstairs to kill Fumi. I'm going to be pissed off. Oh, oh man. I'm going to be so mad. Anyways, this is harsh reality. The true nightmare is this reality. Your reality. Those... Fuck you, Monica. I also noticed those two were the only ones who were hoarding uh, Chihiro's AI. Uh, yeah, it is alter possible. Alter ego. Yeah, alter so, ego. They're the only ones who gave a shit the about The robot alter ego. justice was jealous of them and he killed but them. But still... Why is this happening? Also, wait, there are only two people in here. Oh, no, wait, she's passed out. So, uh, does that count as three people uh, discovering the body if she is passed out? I don't know. Why is this happening? Hmm. Ugh. Wow, okay, that one's fucking huge. That's four. Another hammer. Now it's Justice Hammer 4, and it's even bigger than before. Is that suspicious individual responsible for killing Taka, too? Yeah. They're just being silent. Well, and she... T Toko? Don't tell me Toko, too. Relax, she just passed out when she saw the blood. she should wake up in three, two, two one. one. The blood? Uh -oh. oh, that's right. Uh, when Toko is um Toko, she has a fear of blood. We've tried everything to wake her up, but no luck. Just give her... Just leave her be now. It's like she, he said, I should just leave her alone for now. But why is it Justice Hammer 4? Huh? What do you mean? Celeste was attacked with one. Then Hifumi was hit with two. 
But this time it was four. What happened to three? Ah! Uh, what? What's the matter? Well, you mentioned, mentioned Justice Hammer 3. You just reminded what? me. Out with it. Do you know something? Actually, Tuck is not the only one who's been killed. Ifumi's dead, too. What? She is pissed. Ifumi's been killed? Yeah. Which, Which is, is why you came to get us. Yes. Then... We'd better go check it out. Another body's been discovered! I'm waiting for yeah, it. Yeah, of course. Come on. I don't think he does it more than once. Guess not. So Sakura, Biaki, and I rush to the physics lab. It's because you saw him at the same time talking. I rush and out of the physics lab. But as soon as we get out of the physics lab... Ah, uh, Celeste, are you supposed to be in the nurse's office? Something has come up. Yeah, I heard Hifumi is dead, right? Well, that is not all. It is gone. Huh? huh? What's gone? It it has disappeared. Disappeared? Ifumi's body has disappeared. What? Remember, there were three people in there too. Yeah. Ifumi was not dead. Oh yeah. <laughs> so he just got up and left. <laughs> and that was the body that was actually discovered. Huh. Maybe. Or he's not dead. One of them's not dead. Yeah. What? Yeah, one of them must have got knocked out. Yeah. What are you talking about? It just disappeared. Don't be ridiculous. I... Uh, I don't fucking know what to tell are you. Are you serious? What? Look, it's not there. What more do you want me? What the heck is happening here? Everyone what back It's happening the right now! No one is leaving. Oh, wait. Did we get... Did we get murderer Sama? <laughs> I don't think we did. I yeah, it, we leapt down the stairs. The only one who would not be dead is Hifumi. He could have just got up and walked yeah. out. I reached the nurse's office completely out of breath. Now what about Oi? Ah! Uh, I couldn't believe my eyes. Hifumi's body was there just a few minutes ago. It just disappeared. She is dazed. Me and Celeste went to the bathroom. We only got like a minute, and then when we got back... It must be a the work. A minute. Yeah, it must be the work of the... Yeah. A fucking <laughs> minute. I'm fucking calling it. It's a goddamn one minute fucking time, time machine. machine. This must be the work of the culprit. They must have come and carried the body away. They must be really enjoying this. Enjoying the sight of us standing around frightened and confused. We're all going to die here. I like how she's giving the same face as Junko. We're going to die just like those guys died. What did you say? I don't believe this. I don't believe a body would just disappear. After my plan was so perfect. <laughs> Why? First, there were two murderers, and now... Murders. Murders, and now one of the bodies has been taken. Taken, 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 taken. That was a good movie. Yeah. This is unnatural. Hold on, what do you mean two murders? Tuck has been killed. We found him in the equipment. No way! It, it can't be Taka too. It can't be, it can't be! No! no! I liked him. Hina, calm down. We're all gonna die, all of us. They're gonna kill all of us. Oh great, now she's hysterical the odd day with it. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, woman, would you shut the fuck up? Then who might be the next target B, Toko? Huh? We left her back. I completely forgot. She's still unconscious in the equipment room. How could you forget the serial killer? And also, wait, no, it's fine. You left her in the scene of the crime? We didn't have a choice. She passed out. She refused to wake up. Also, remember, there can only be two murders. Well, yeah, but who's going to stop that? <laughs> Like, seriously, is Monokuma gonna kill the murderer if they try to kill someone else? Maybe, like, I don't- Like, what the fuck would happen? I don't know. I wonder if that's explored. Probably not in this game. So, is she still unconscious? Damn. Wait, so you knew she was still up there and said nothing? Why? That annoying little insect that clings to me wherever I go, we'd be better off without her. You shouldn't abandon your girlfriend. Fuck her. That's the plan. <laughs> you bastard! Calm down, you forgot about her, didn't you? You have no right to blame me. I'm pretty sure I do. Everyone stop fighting. Right now, we need to hurry back. I can't take this anymore. I don't want anyone else to die. 
Byakuya, something's happened to Toko. I'll never forgive you. Why, why do you care so much if the females die? What about the men? <laughs> well, no, I guess she also <laughs> cares about Fumi as well. I don't know this character. <laughs> I think she cares about everyone either. I guess. We shot out of the nurse's office and bolted up to the stairs, heading back to the third floor. We're all getting way too much exercise today. We meet Jack the Ripper at the third floor. <laughs> Ran back to the equipment room at full speed, and when we got there... Are you motherfucking serious? She's fine. Toko! But Taka... Thank God you're okay, but right away I noticed there was something very different here. No body! Uh, it was gone! Taka's body, which should have been right there, had disappeared. This... This can't be happening. I'm literally getting pissed off. Somebody is making this more interesting, and it's not me! That's I... my job, bitch! I'm not understanding. Are we hallucinating all this or something? No, it's it's not a hallucination. The dead body alarm went off. I know I yeah. saw it before. And what I'm seeing now isn't what I saw before. Huh? What, you saying talk had disappeared too? Stop saying disappeared. But that's what happened. It didn't just vanish into thin air. Obviously, whoever did this has hidden the body somehow. Why the fuck would they do that? Oh, wait, I guess. Well, I was asking that. But yeah. why would they do that? I couldn't possibly begin to imagine. And that pisses me off more than anything. It seems like it. Anyway, our costume suspect is clearly continuing his crime spree. God. Toko's gonna wake up, he's like, and she's gonna be like, He's trying to out-murder me! I'm, I'm the fucking serial killer here, what the hell is going on? <laughs> we gotta hurry up and catch him before he kills all of us! Oh, I don't think you have to worry about that. Huh? Think about it. Who could possibly be responsible for killing and hiding these dead bodies? Um... What? When Hafumi's death cry went up, everyone here was together on the third floor. After that, we split into two groups. And now this time, you all came here as a group from the nurse's office. In other words, the only ones who could have done this are Hiro and Kyoko, who are still missing. Uh, hold on a second. Kyoko has an alibi for when Celeste and Fumi were attacked. There's no question she was in the dining hall with us. Hmm. You seem very ad adamant at about defending her. I mean, Bay is perfect, but also, in this <laughs> case, she actually still had the alibi. Yeah. Perhaps you are Stop in love. Stop stealing my jokes from me! That's not it at all. Well, anyway, yes, I do accept Kyoko's alibi. Which means the suspicious individual we are looking for can be none other than Hiro. Which further means there will be no more murders the regulations are very clear about that. Oh, that's right. There's a rule that says you can only kill a maximum of two that's people. Right. As long as that rule is in place, there will not be a third murder. If if they were to break that rule... I admit ya! Mince ya without a second thought! Mince ya, grind ya, turn ya into paste! I knew it! I knew I By knew the he way, would prevent a third murder. By the way, did you know that fish paste can also refer to shellfish, like shrimp or crabs? Oh, so we are actually learning something. I guess there still is a school. Indeed. <laughs> just as headmaster, it's my job to, <laughs> that you still learn things. Just not the things you're supposed to learn. <laughs> so since two people have been killed, there is no possibility of any more. I disagree. Yeah, that minigun. <laughs> no, I disagree still. Why? It doesn't, the regulation doesn't say... Only two people can be killed at once. It says one person can only kill two people. So if you if you convince someone to kill someone else, and then you kill them, you can still kill another person. Yes. So that is not true. <laughs> Perhaps. You knew that from the beginning, didn't you, Byakuya? Which means you knew Toko was never in danger. I still meant it when I said we'd be better off without her, though. Look, I would have killed her already if it wasn't for the fact that somebody else did it first. Well, yeah. not kill Kyoko. But, Kyoko. you know, they, they already yeah. started the killing spree yeah. before I didn't I get, get a chance here. to kill her before somebody else killed someone. In other words, 
Anyway, with that in mind, we can now relax and search for the two missing bodies. Or can you? The two missing bodies. Two people have been killed and their bodies have gotten been hidden. The only one without a halibi, the only one who could have done it, is Hero. So somehow it's not going to be him because that's too straightforward for this. Yep. But is he really the kill- Thank you, game. What about Kyoko? If she's not involved in this, where the fuck is she? Hey, Makoto, what's the matter? I'm thinking! Uh, no, it's nothing. Whatever, we need to find those bodies or lit- Or our little narrative here can't move forward. Very well, then let us split up and begin searching. No! No splitting! But... Oh, but... <laughs> There's no need to be afraid. No more murders will take place during this case. I, mean... uh, I know that. I mean, I think I do, but... If you're still nervous, I'll go with you. Huh? Okay, th thank you. No need to thank me. <laughs> then let's get moving, y'all. Yell out. <laughs> yell out. Y'all yell out if yell, you yell, find yell. anything. <laughs> Biakia left the equipment room followed by the others. I have to try and fi find the two missing bodies. Where the fuck could they be? Where would you hide a body? Well, mm. let's see. Um, well, we can't go to the fourth floor. In storage uh, room and boxes. We could go to the art room. Yeah, let's try the art room. Storage room and boxes. Yeah, <laughs> well, that's possible too. But let's start here because it's right here. Oh, they started here too. Damn. Uh, check the back room. Huh? The door is locked. What the fuck? Amazing. Okay. Can't go in there, apparently. Monokuma has prevented us from checking the storage room. Yeah, back room. Uh... Let's check the rec room since we're here. Let me guess who's going to oh, be here. Oh, here's a disturbing thought on the ceiling nailed up. I'm surprised that Celeste isn't here. I was totally uh, sure she'd check here. What's the door to your left? Uh, it just goes back out. It, it's the... It's in case you can't hit the B button for whatever re reason. They have a, uh... Oh, okay. They have a door in every room so you can back out. Yeah, I... Getting real tired of this shit. Yeah, I don't think it would be in the classroom. Oh. <sighs> Makito. Come on. Why are you just standing there? We need to get to the repository. Huh? You mean... I found them. Hifumi and Taka's bodies have both been hidden in the repository. I've already told Hina and Sakura we'll go on ahead. Their bodies are in the repository? But I just checked there. Wait, the repository? It's the room behind the art room. Oh. A locked door. <laughs> so you had to wait for someone else to basically yes. bust the door down. Are the bodies here somewhere? Up ahead's the repository. The door not turned. I guess it's unlocked. Well, let's go in. It's another trick. So I opened the door, and when I entered, I saw... More dead bodies! Some kind of mess. Why? I like how they're making such a big deal of it, even though we'd already seen them. The two bodies I guess who threw me is dead. Here. The smell of blood made me gag. What I saw before my eyes was unquestionable, unavoidable, unwavering reality. And then I heard an announcement for the second time. Ding dong, ding dong! A body has been discovered. Maybe Thank Hifumi you, Monokuma. Was... Maybe Hafumi wasn't dead. He did walk out. I don't know. I, I like how it's a pre-recorded message. Yeah. And so here we are! Without further ado, let me give you all the next Monokuma file. I was... Going to hand them out when you found the bodies the first time, but I thought something might happen. But only on the hub network! <laughs> uh, the phone has gone off. That's okay. Uh, it was really hard to resist, but turns started. out I was right. Just had it over already. Now make sure to investigate with all your mental might and prepare for the class trial! See Well then, now that we found the bodies, all that's left is to uncover the culprit. What the heck? Hold on! How can you be so calm? I mean, they're dead, you know. Terrible. Dead, gone forever. They're never coming back. 
We are never ever getting back together, damn it. Hey, look, hammers. Awful, it's just too awful. Yeah, there are. Weren't were there more hammers on that shelf? Yes. Good, so we know that the hammers came from here. Hina suddenly burst into tears. She clutched at Hifumi's lifeless body. Oh, well, fuck you, too. We don't know, Supreme Kai. Large wet tears fell from her eyes. The tears landed on Ifumi's cheeks. If this were some world of make-believe, like Mr. Rogers' land of make-believe, that might have been when Ifumi yeah, opened Hifumi his eyes. Yeah, Ifumi was a very nice guy. I don't think he but deserved this. But this wasn't a movie. At all. No way it's a movie. Wow, they animated this scene. Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah, also, she's the Supreme Kai of Time, so she can heal people. What? This isn't a movie! I just said it's not a movie! She's alive again? What the fuck? Where, Where am I? Code. Co code. Oh. Code. Is winter coming? Yes. Hifumi, wake up! Uh, he's already awake. Uh, uh he, he didn't speak. Uh, that's right. I remember now. Hope's peak. Come on, you gotta wake up. Remember. Uh, oh, he's he's talking right now. Before I met you all, I met you all. What the fuck does that mean? His memories are all blending together. He has nothing useful to offer us. Walk away from it! Reaching out to me like the tail of a fox. Okay. Hifumi, who was it? Who attacked you? Who tried to kill you? Who killed me? Yeah, past, yeah, past tense. Yeah. That's right. I remember their name. Yashihiro. Yasuhiro. Yep. <laughs> His eyes closed, and they never opened again. Oh, man. I thought he was going to come out of it like... Death for the second time. Absolute, undeniable So he died death. and somehow came back. Yeah. Okay, guys. We're going to wrap up here and come back next time. Hifumi, you were a trooper. Yeah. Yes, you were. Until then, everyone, remember, the future is very uncertain. But what is certain is, you guys are awesome, and there'll be more Two Bros Game Night tomorrow. See you then. Goodbye.